Did you know that there's another Netflix Masters of the Universe series coming out? Comes out, I think, this month. In fact, January 25th, it comes out. And the comments on this video are quite interesting, such as, when you see this series, He-Man will not be the protagonist. I'll wait until the reviews are in. The first series had promising trailers as well. We know how that turned out. I won't give Kevin Smith any of my time until I'm sure I'm not wasting it. And I can't figure out why Evil Lynn isn't treated like the war criminal that she is. Uh, this one says it's going to be absolute shit. Well, this is going to be shit. but uh, The trailer, like the first series, looks good. Uh, I cannot deny that this trailer looks great. A lot of He-Man in it. A lot of He-Man in it. Uh, a lot of Skeletor in it. But I'm going to probably go ahead and guess that the battle between He-Man and Skeletor will probably be a side battle in this show, just like it was <laughs> in the last one, because Kevin Smith doesn't want to give people what they want. Uh, for some reason, he likes to play games. I don't know how the hell this got a second season, because from what I remember, the first one fell off the charts real fast. Maybe these are cheap to make. I, I don't know. Uh, but what I do find funny is after all the back and forth between Neon and Kevin Smith, he finally blocked him. Now, this is funny for a big reason. Because if you remember, uh, Kevin Smith absolutely tried to destroy Clownfish TV, dragged them through the mud, uh, and they were right. They had a scoop. They called him out as a liar. It brought a lot of attention to the, sh to the show. He tried to damage control say that it wasn't real, they were lying, and then the show came out, and it was never about He-Man. In fact, He-Man got cucked in it, and that was the end of the show, and now we're getting another one. But it's like, damn, Kevin, you know, you could have just... I mean, this is a straightforward case of, of him really being wrong on this one. And it's like, I get it, they ruin your show, you're a little surprised, but maybe you should have never made He-Man the secondary character in his own series. Because remember, the original series was called He-Man and the Masters of the Universe. So I just found this kind of funny. And this isn't, this isn't the only thing going on. This trailer kind of looks like it's going to be a shit show as well. And the reason I say that is right at the beginning, the first thing you hear about this trailer is Adam talking to his father who's dying and telling him, you can't be He-Man and a king at the same time. So he's going to keep the power and give the king the king's crown probably to, to a woman. That's my guess. Or he's going to keep the crown and give the He-Man power to somebody else. And I bet you a dollar it's going to be Andrea. Remember the, the other character, the female character they, they introduced, who's probably uh, lovers with Tila. So I'm just saying... It's uh, it's not looking good. I don't think this show is gonna be is gonna be good. I think it's gonna be more of the same, and a lot of people are seeing that. They put a lot of He Man in this trailer. I'll say that, uh, but the first one had it as well. Now the really interesting thing about this that I want to point out is that the views are really low. Uh, this only has one hundred eighty four thousand views. Now the first trailer for this series, Masters of the Universe, uh, whatever, I forget the name of the first one. That trailer had like 9 million views. I think this is important. Here it is right here. Masters of the Universe Revelation official teaser. Two years ago, 9 million views. Why is that important? The reason I think that that's important is because it shows you just how far interest has fallen for this series. Now, if you look here, the official teaser that dropped two months ago is only at 494,000 views. Okay, three months ago, 580,000 views for a first look. They gave us a, a whole scene, E-Man versus Scareglow. Got a whole scene on it. Still doesn't even crack a million. 
if they had just done the show right, this is what this tells me by looking at this. If this show had been done right in the first place and given people the He-Man show that they deserved, uh, this show would also have millions of views on it and people would probably be excited for it and they wouldn't be saying shit like, uh, I have the power to not watch this garbage from Master of the TDS. Where's Tila? Isn't this her show? Uh, Nightwing says, I want to trust you, but you lied the last time. Jacob, Jacob Airy says, nice try. Uh, you got a thing here of uh, Kevin Smith stabbing He-Man in the back. <laughs> and why? This is a good question from Wolf of Weeb Street. Why is this called anime when it's clearly not an anime? So, I think the views for this show are going to be very, very low. Very, very low. I think it's going to fall off the charts real fast. And if we ever find out the ratings for it, I think it's going to be very embarrassing if you can compare it to the first series. Because that trailer tells me everything. Nine million views down to half a million. No one's buying your bullshit anymore, Kevin Smith. No one's buying your bullshit. Anyway, that's pretty much it. Let me know what you guys think about all this. I'd like to hear from you in the comments. Also, if you would, please like, subscribe, share the video. Make sure you're still subscribed. Hit that notification bell. Check out my Rumble and Locals, and I will see you on the next one. Peace. Make sure to check out my Locals. There's a link in the description. It's a fun community that I'm trying to build over here. If you don't want to support me on YouTube, you can come over here. None of that money goes to YouTube. You also can just come over here for free. But if you are a supporter over here, I do plan on doing an extra live stream once a month and throwing links to the supporters so you can actually come on and have a supporter live stream with me. Also, it's a good place to catch all of my content. You don't have to worry about notifications like YouTube. They'll definitely work over here. So come check out my locals.